Welcome back to some Greedfall. So, good vibes today, people. Good vibes. <laughs> We're gonna have some good vibes today. Even though today's already been a fucking nightmare. But we won't get into that. Um, just a lack of sleep. Anywho, demonical cults. Here we go. There's also somebody to speak to over here. I'm quite intrigued what she wants. Pardon. I'm from the congregation of merchants. My name is Desade. To whom do I have the Desade. Sister Ephesia, envoy of Teleme, by the grace of the illuminated. Enchanted. The mother cardinal has tasked me to investigate the activities of this village. Oh. She also sent me here to be your second. Oh god. I'm shifting in my chair. Oh my fucking Paddings moved. Right, okay, here we go. How has your mission fared up until now, sister? Not very well, I'm afraid. <clears throat> Tell me your knowledge, woman. Woman. Their chief and their priest are evasive when questioned. As for the other natives, their behavior can be quite odd. They'll spend hours just staring into the void. More well, fucking anything's better than the world we live in. <laughs> They frighten me. Jesus been. Christ. There's a heavy veil of evil here. I feel it, but I'm not able to find from whence it comes. Perhaps you should talk to them. They may speak to you. Well, I plan to. Everyone keeps saying I slightly look like a native, so. Uh, pardon me. Prepare yourself for some burps. I've had some chicken and I've got a tango. I've got a tango today. I've got a tango. Um, yes, I've, I'm running on a lack of sleep because <clears throat> the upstairs neighbour decided to just plonk some scaffolding right outside my bedroom window at 8 o'clock this morning and a lot of drilling took place. So, that's fun, isn't it? That's lovely. Uh, here we go. Deirdre. Deirdre, the village chief. Deirdre, woman. Madam. Man. It may be neither. We shall see. Investigations will be made. We've unlocked a fast travel. Uh, also, Batman should be out by now. So, surprise! Batman! <laughs> I hope you're all excited for that. I'm really fucking excited for it, so you better be. Madam. What have you got on your face? Oh, is that face paint? She's got green hair. Oh. Oh, Deirdre? Deirdre? Is it you who helped my warriors discover what the men of the Red Sun were doing? Indeed. Yes. Then I thank you. I think. We've got a bit of frame drop. Because you are an honor Manawi, that you are different from the other Renaikse. What do you seek? Uh, Demons, basically. Tell me about your rituals. Oh, ask about the demon. Oh. Do you know anything about a demon that would be worshipped by your clan? It is not enough to take us for idiots. And now you accuse us of bowing down to evil creatures. No, 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 no. Needs to fear, so I will not prove you wrong. An enemy who knows fear is already defeated. I was just curious. What can you tell me about your rituals? Ah, oh, you have heard this question before. You sound like the mind shaker woman. The rituals are the business. I'm guessing that's uh, the sister. Anything more? Uh, no, I think that's it, thank you. Uh, will M. Seg. Right, um... Question the village... Don... Donigad? Donigad? I don't know. I'm trying, okay? The, I love when games put in their own languages, uh, like, full-blown languages, not just... Like, oh, we'll drop a word every so often, so like... Seeing people actually say full sentences or like half sentences in like a fully native language is pretty cool. Especially for like such a small game like Greedfall. Small in retrospect to everything else. Good day. Sir. Are you the wise man of this village? <laughs> he you says in quotation marks, the wise man. I say. I am the Donegad. The Donegad? I would like to ask you a few questions. If you <laughs> I was going to say something like that. <laughs> <laughs> He's the Donny Gad, and I'm the Donny Lad. 
And that's how lo that's how little sleep I've had. <laughs> and it all rhymed. <laughs> oh, I fucking hate myself. Answer your own questions. At least then the answers will please you. And we shall be done with your foolishness. Whoa. May your answers fill your day with the bounty. Well, that was very, very rude. I guess we'll go ask somebody else. I'm gonna be a prick about it. Oh, we've got loads of people to ask. We get to learn about the village properly. Can't you leave us alone? Oh. All right. Oh shit, have I got to wear something else? Someone's got to speak to me. Leave me be. Even your thoughts are loud and break my Fuck. Face. You, madam. You have a strange stare, Anaixe. Leave me alone. Fuck. Uh. Shit, I don't have any tribal gear. Is that what I need? I can't tell. Hello? Anybody want to have a chit chat? A little chit chat? No, I'm not interested in chit chat. They're all just going to stare at me. Let's have a look at the fucking thing. What we got? Yeah, it's literally just question the inhabitants. But then there's also... I don't know, maybe there's some other inhabitants that we can discover if we wander around. There's somebody over here. Hello? <gasps> Pardon? Do you want something? Um, a, a cult? Could you answer a few questions? Questions, questions. It is a word that you adore. Let us play a game. Knowledge. If you answer my questions, I will answer yours. Okay. If the only way to get answers, then let's play. I am pleased. We will have fun. But beware, no lies. I'll be the judge of that. Given the place from where you come. Um, well, we might as well tell her. Alright, don't flex. It is possible that you come from there, but I believe that this is not your land. Your turn. Is that the whole fucking hint to the native thing? We know, we know, I'm a native. Um, rituals, rituals, rituals. Oh, I see what interests you. You want to know how our warriors are so strong. Exactly. I have an answer. Oh. It is a secret of the Donega. The rituals I know yeah. are made to celebrate nature, to honor and bring her blessings upon us. Let's try something else. Does Mother Nature have lovely blessings? With your land, or did you inherit your link from your parents? I'm not bound, or at least I haven't done anything in particular to bind myself. Then it was your parents. One of them at least must have been Donegad. Your turn. Okay, this is actually quite informative. Could you tell me more about your beliefs? What a strange question. I don't Why? Believe. I know. Nature is alive. A forest is like a village. Every river, every rock, Every beast, the land itself, all live, all speak to us. You can believe in something that lives. We honor her, give her our dead. This is the way of things. We do everything in our power to protect her. It was fun. More than with the woman who makes light, she did not want to play. I only got to ask two questions. Shit. There's somebody up there. Hello? Birtir to Mad and Al Manawi. What do you want? What can you tell me about your rituals? Our rituals? Nothing. Nothing at all. Nobody knows. They do not concern me. I am not a Denegad. Even you. You should be able to tell that. Why do you me? 
with these questions. I am only a gatherer. Because no other fucker will speak to me. Else. Don't be a dick. This question will seem strange to you, but do you know anything about a demon? A demon? A dark spirit, if you prefer. No. There is no such thing as dark spirits. Your question is not strange. Foolish, perhaps. Oi! I fucking slap you. Tell me about the missionaries that came here. Those who wear the symbol of the sun on their clothing. When they came, they spoke about their bright and shiny god. They told us we were wrong. Oh! That nature was just God, I love cracking my bones. We These men know nothing. Oh, I'm having a lovely stretch, sorry. <laughs> and then the woman came to us. She sniffed around everywhere, asking many questions just like you. I was oh. told that she tried to enter my own home. I even saw her trying to follow me in the woods. She must be careful. It is easy to get lost in the woods or cross paths. With wild beasts. All right, let's start with the subtle threats. You're different from the others. What is your role in the village? Different? Why? Well, for one, you answer me when I speak. You others, when we don't answer you, you start digging for answers everywhere else. I am a gatherer. I hunt and answer the fucking questions then. Part for the life of the village. Put it this way. If I don't fucking find out what's going on, Sister fucking Cardinal, Sister Cardinal, Mother Cardinal, and the Great Wizard of fucking, I don't fucking know, the Delhi Lama or whatever, are going to come down and fucking set you all on fire. So, someone's going to fucking tell me what's going on, otherwise, San Mateus is going to be having barbecues. Alright? It's pretty fucking simple. Why can't we just say that to them? Sister. Anything Sister. No. The investigation has gone stale. The villagers won't even engage in conversation. I've got an itch on the bottom of my foot. Perhaps you should talk to them. Oh, I've tried. I've tried. Exchange a few words with some villagers, but I admit they don't seem keen to talk. They fucking hate me. Anything worth sharing? I know no. more about their beliefs. They worship nature and do not intend to change. It is certainly different from the luminous faith, but it's hardly demonic worship. Yet, there's something strange about this village. One of the villagers that spoke with me seemed truly worried. On edge, even. I think I know of whom you speak. A man always looking over his shoulder. Because you've been fucking following him. out of the village like a thief. I attempted to follow him, but he always eludes me. I tried to get into his... Maybe he's been doing soup, like secret rituals. But someone was always there. Then we should give it a try. Perhaps we'll fare better. Oh yeah, three of us. Well, we'll just wander in then. We'll have to distract him. We could break one of the cops that would keep him busy. Oh. Or we could ask for help. I can mm. pretend to be clumsy, but we'll have to work fast and it will only work once. Do you want something? Yes. Might I ask you a few questions about the villagers? More questions? You really like this game. Look, you I'll really fucking tell you how big my dick is, or the fucking really circumference of my arsehole, whatever you want to know. Because it is not good fun. Right, uh. What can you tell me about that man down there? I spoke to him, and he seemed nervous. Don't hold it against him. The people of the light have already questioned us. That makes him distrustful. He is a man of few words, but he is devoted to the village and listens to the Dene God with great attention. He is a gatherer, but everyone knows he wants to become the next Vogelendijk, the next servant of Dene God. Where does this man live? Down there. His dwelling is right in front of my own. <laughs> Wonderfully vague. What? Why would you want to do that? It is his home. You have nothing to do there if you are not invited. I really must go inside. I need to clarify something. If you can help us. This request is strange. I know it is for you as well. 
But we must prove that these suspicions cast upon our village are not. Oh my God! Thank God we've got Ciara. will not give up their search without this. Hmm. Very well. Oh my God! If we didn't have Ciara, we might not have been able to do that. And be respectful of what you find there. Be good. Okay, go, 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 go. Oh no. Where I meant to wait. Ah, here we go. Oi. Okay, go, 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 go. What is it? What is it? What? Oh my god, he's doing rituals. Incredibly morbid. I wonder what sort of spirit could be venerated in this way. This sort of offering and its seals are Look at this. nothing that we call upon in our rituals. Oh my days, my stomach's gurning. Because I'm like suppressing burps, so it's like. Ugh. God, there's loads of them. I will admit that it's rather ghastly, but I'm almost certain that the warriors of this island wear these things in battle. Maybe he's calling upon dark strength? Evoking war. A massacre. A bloodbath under the likeness of a grimacing face. I have never seen anything like this. We need to get out of here. This is very violent and bloody. Deirdre's clan has always been a bit different. We should go tell Sister of Pisia about it. I don't know if we should. If she goes back and says this to fucking Mother Cardinal, there'll be a bloody squadron of paladins at the front door. Did you learn anything? No. Nothing more. Were you able to get inside the nervous man's hut? I was able to sneak into the hut of our mystery man. And what did you discover? Some troubling things. A ritual mask, a rather morbid altar, and a fresco depicting a massacre. By the enlightened. To think these unholy things were so near. Finally, the proof we need that there's a blood worshipping cult here. No, 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 no. It's just one man. Pagan rituals in the village, and I am certain that it's where our nervous friend sneaks off to. I fail to find where he goes, but you have already proven more competent than I. I shall try. Surely it's not a cult. Thank you for your help, and good luck. Well, we're gonna get led into a trap. We should wait until nightfall and follow him. It is nightfall. Here we go. Let's hide in the bushes. Hide in the bushes. Here we could hide and wait. We would be able to see where this sleepless boy goes during nightfall. Wake up, Greenblood. He's here. What? Who? Oh, he is here. We shall follow him to his domain, wherever he cast upon the devil. I don't like all of this demonical stuff. <gasps> Shit. Fuck. Well, shit. I don't know if I triggered something there or not. He just sort of stopped moving and I kind of ran into him. There's a lot of bones. There's a lot of bones. I've gone down the wrong way. I would like to point out that the map in this game is really fucking useful. It's a shame we had to kill somebody that was so, sp like, communicative. Communicative? Communicative. That talked so much to us. He was quite nice in that regard. <laughs> It's not in any other regard. Oh, I also learned how to hotkey uh, things onto the D-pad, like bringing up the tactical menu, which I knew how to do, I just didn't do it for some reason. <laughs> I don't know what Shadow Burst is. <gasps> oh my days, that was nice. Okay, so the combat, if I use the tactical pause menu, can be a lot more like... Knights of the Old Republic, which is pretty cool. We all love a good bit of KOTOR. Good bit of KOTOR, KOTOR.
get rickety wrecked. Can I get beast essence from these? No, I can get bile. Bile. Oh, I can get some beast essence. I'm guessing it's just a smaller chance. Look at these, they're like standing stones. Oh my days. Find a way to enter the passage. Oh no, it's going to be a fucking... Oh, it's going to be a bloody puzzle. Oh, fuck me. I'm going to have to, like... I'm going to end up having to Google this, Anna. I? I can already tell. Some of these are, like, different colours. Do I have to... Pazam! A la kazoo. A bippity boo, a bippity boppity boo. Oh. I've triggered a cutscene. What the fuck? <coughs> His face then. I was like, I fucking feel you. What's going on? Oh my days. This is cool. What's happening? I don't know. You are so pale. Did the lightning struck tree speak to you? In a way. Kinda. <clears throat> I saw many images. They were so real. As if I was the tree itself. Do tell. This vision. <laughs> Sounded sarcastic. Oh, do tell. And my branches were shaken by a storm so strongly that they hurt terribly. The heavens caught fire several times and I felt the lightning strike and pierce me through and through. A sinister warmth took hold of my entire body in an instant and flames began to devour me. Life left me. All was calm and I had a taste of cinder in my mouth. In spite of this, I continued to feel and the rain began to fall on my roots and at the very heart of my being I felt the sap begin to flow again a shoot appeared on my darkened roots then this is very poetic I have never experienced anything like it before well that's beautiful um... <laughs> the drawing on this stone represents lightning I must have lit the candles in the wrong order. Oh, fuck me. Have I got to go in like a... Oh, no. I'm guessing it's a process of elimination. I ain't got the time for it. <laughs> I'm just going to get to my phone. Oh, I can't remember what he's just said. And my branches were shaken by a storm so strongly that they hurt terribly. Okay. Heavens caught fire several times and I felt the lightning strike and pierce the drawing on this stone resembles a symbol that must represent the earth. The drawing on this stone makes me think of fire. I'm certain this drawing looks like an infant. Could it represent life? On this stone the sun is visible. This stone has an image of the moon. Okay, wow, I fucking, I can't remember. Eaten away. That's the cinder at the it end. Like a snowflake. A snowflake. The snow, or maybe Lightning. Else. This stone bears the image of a storm. Ah. Then he was struck by lightning. See? See. What happened after he was struck by light? Is it literally telling me the order? Oh. Oh, it's not telling me the order, but it's giving me hints. Because I mean, the infant stone is pretty irrelevant. Okay, one minute, one minute, one minute. Greedfall, tree, stone puzzle. <laughs> 
<laughs> this is just going to be a lot easier because I can't be asked. Okay, so apparently we start with a wind. Which is this one. This stone bears the image of a storm. Oh, no we know. Wind, then lightning, then fire. Is that fire? No, that's death. Big death boys. Sun, infant, fire. Uh, then we got deaf. Big deaf boys. And then we got water. Water. This stone is adorned with the etching of a drop of water. And then life. I mean, it makes sense, but I would never have fucking got it if the markers weren't there. And I still didn't get it, so... <laughs> oh god, I don't know what we're going to find down here. I don't really want to know what we're going to find down here. It's this fucking place. Maybe it'd be like a secret garden of Eden. Oh, fuck me. So maybe there is a cult. That are all fucking blood summoning something. Oh, fuck. Uh-oh. Oh, I don't like that. There's a lot of them as well. I think they might be starting a war. Oh, my cape. In any case, Teleme's story suddenly sounds way more plausible. The Denegad who performed the ritual was the villagers. We should go talk to Deirdre. I told you. I told you it's not happening. It's not happened yet. It's going to happen. I still stick by that theory. I reckon everything we saw is what's going to happen and a fucking demonic war is going to start. The fucking volcano is probably going to pop. Oh my days. Right, where is uh, Deirdre? 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 I've forgotten her name. It's not Deirdre. Oh Deirdre. I think Deirdre is a Coronation Street character. Or was a Coronation Street character. Deirdre Balo. What do you seek? Deirdre. We found your sanctuary and assisted in one of your blood rituals. Was the apparition we witnessed the demon the priests were talking about? What is clear is these priests know nothing and you know nothing. The ritual. I've never seen anything like it. I hoped you'd be able to explain what they were trying to achieve. As you can see, my companion is not a Renaigse like the others. He bears our likeness. Please share your knowledge with us. Grant us the chance to understand. Very well. I'll attempt to help you make Wait, sense Wait, so of what everyone knew about this? The ritual you saw is a ceremony to summon forth the strength of our warriors. Right. Our people have always lived in harmony with nature. Our very existence revolves around her. She talks to us and takes on many faces. What you have witnessed is just one of many. Confronting the threat that the Renoixi make up, we call them for their blessing, and they appeared to us. Can we contact them? I mean, is communication possible? What you witnessed was not a discussion, but if you visit a sanctuary, you may see one of the faces, and then you will be able to talk. Pass the mountains and head to the swamps. There. Oh God, the swamps. The ritual, you will see them come. Though what you will hear may not be to your liking. 
No fucking brilliant. Uh. <laughs> well, at least we leveled up. Uh, so we got a point into this. Was I saving up for anything? I bought Shadow Burst last time. It's not a bad move, to be fair, so I kind of want to do it. Let's do it. Let's upgrade it. Uh, now that I actually understand that you can bind some of these things, it makes a lot more sense. Attributes, we've got one. I don't know if we were saving up. Um, it doesn't particularly look like we were saving up. <laughs> I've already forgotten. Let's upgrade our spells. And then... We haven't got any points in talents yet. I almost called it taints. Face to face with the demon. Find the sanctuary indicated by Deirdre. So whereabouts are we looking for this? Will it show me? So somewhere in this area, from the looks of it, so we're going to have to go for a gander into an untamed land. I mean, if this... Oh, this looks like the swamps, actually. This looks very swampy, so that makes a lot more sense. I wonder what that is there, like, on the map. Because I've not seen that building yet. I don't know. We'll have to wait and see. Um, I hope you've enjoyed... Uh, oh, my God. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Feel free to leave a thumbs up. I'm going to leave it there. And I will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.